Hey everybody, Greg here. When I got this, gonna give it a test. As you know, prices of these 3D targets, they can get crazy. Uh, this is the cheapest one I could find. It's normally 80, I got it for 60 bucks. You know, my Delta McKenzie woodchuck was more than this. You know, and I understand with the price and quality, that's how it's gonna go. But what I'm gonna do, this is a Memorial Day weekend. I'm gonna take this out to a dude ranch where I'm going and I'm just gonna shoot the living daylights out of it. And I'll tell you how it holds up. So before we do anything else, let's cut it open and see what we got. Okay, first impression, <laughs> cheap, but it, <laughs> 60 bucks. Antlers. Body target insert, legs and instructions, okay, see there's little rods in here, alright, looks pretty simple, you know what, should be easy to build, Let's see what my directions say, it says it has replaceable core, that's good. I uh, give you a little closer view. You know, paint job's not bad. Probably done by some guy with an airbrush. There's the body. Fairly soft form. I can see where that's going to be a problem with the legs. I might epoxy it. You know, the horns are a hard plastic. Replaceable foam insert. And hard plastic legs. I'll put it together and see what it looks like. Okay, they go in real easy. Just push them in. Well, there we go. Horns are real easy, you know, you might want to epoxy them. One side is bigger than the other. I love brute strength. And there he is, all built. Pretty simple. Dry these in the ground, set them in. All right, I'm gonna take them out and shoot the living snot out of them. With an average price of around $90 in the box stores, I bought mine for $60 online, and I did a little more searching, and I found it for as low as $42 online. Looks, I know this is subjective, and let's be honest, this looks like a malnourished deer with only two legs. But you put it out at like 20 yards, and it, it works fine. You know what? The horns actually do look good. The head's fine. As long as you're not shooting head on, this is not a bad looking target. With six pieces, this was a simple target to build, and it was reasonably sturdy. Quality, another subjective one, and I give it an average rating. The downside of this one is, like I said, it looks malnutritioned, and it only has two legs. But besides that, everything else is pretty good. Durability, the $10,000 question. Is it durable? Yes, it is. And no, it's not. This target is durable if you hit it in the target core. If you're not accurate enough to keep putting your arrows in there, you're going to destroy this target in a very short period of time. As you see in my pictures here, there's hits all over the place. And what I did is when I went to that dude ranch, I left the target out for three days and I let anybody shoot it. 
And these people were hitting it in the ears, in the butt, in the legs. And those shots outside of the core cause damage. You hit it in those plastic legs, you leave a permanent hole, obviously. But it also cracks it. If you leave it out in the cold weather and things like that, it's only going to get worse. If you're using a powerful bow and you don't hit it in the core, you hit it in the butt, your arrow's going to go through. And when you go through, you take out a good chunk on the backside. This target is not made for people with powerful bows who do not have accuracy. I think the ideal person to use this target would be a traditional archer with a bow 45 pounds and under that's got pretty good accuracy. Now, if you got kids, yeah, they'll be able to shoot it too, you know, because they're inaccurate and they got light poundage bows. Lighter the poundage, the better. The shooter buck. Mine costs 60 bucks, and I'm having a blast with it. It's not the most durable thing. It's not even the most realistic, but it's not supposed to be. It's an economy model, you know what? And it does a great job. It doesn't try to be what it's not. It is what it is. And for that, I give it two thumbs up. Thanks for watching, and have a beautiful day.